Hey guys, hey, welcome back to another episode of Bad Beast Barbecue. Hey, today we're going to be doing some bacon wrapped drumsticks on the Char Griller 980 right after this. He's a bad beast on that barbecue on the grill of the smoker. He knows just what to do. He's a bad beast on that barbecue. All right, guys, so like I mentioned before, we're going to be doing some bacon wrapped drumsticks. Now, we're not going to be making lollipops today, although you could turn this recipe into lollipops if you wanted to. But we're going to just be doing some simple bacon wrapped drumsticks today, okay? And we're going to be seasoning them with uh, Postal Barbecue's uh, chicken rub, okay? Uh, my friend Javen Postal from Canada, uh, the gentleman who created Postal Barbecue, has three rubs out there, and he sent me uh the rubs to try out so we're gonna be trying out the chicken rub today and we're gonna check it out with a little bacon wrapped drumstick okay so come on we're gonna bring you closer and we'll go ahead and prep this chicken right quick and we're gonna get them on the char griller 980 today all right guys so the first thing we want to do is we want to remove the skin from the drumsticks i've already prepped five of them this is the last one so you want to loosen up the skin as much as possible around the top And if you can pull it and gather it all around the knuckle, it should come right off, just like that. All right, so we got them all de-skinned, and now we're going to go ahead and season them up and get them wrapped up, okay? All right, guys, so we got our chicken de-skinned, and so we're going to use uh, Postal Barbecue's chicken rub to season these up. I did a pre-taste of this and it tastes pretty good. It's got like a nice little lime and herbal um, flavor to it. Um, so I'm interested in seeing how this works out and giving Javen some feedback on it. So, but even pre-tasting it before it's cooked, I can already, already tell it's gonna be pretty good. All right. So we got our drumsticks nice and seasoned. Let's go ahead and lay out our bacon. All right, guys, so I got my bacon laid out here. Uh, we're going to be using some leftover jalapeno bacon that I had from the last cook. Plus, we have some regular center cut bacon here that we're going to use. And you want your bacon to be close to room temperature. That way, it's more pliable. And then, so we're going to start with our jalapeno bacon. And I'm going to use the large end here. Start down here at the bottom. Pull and just... Wrap it around like so. And voila. And that's enough bacon. You don't want to overload it. So we'll go ahead and do another one. Start at the bottom. Come around. And that's why you want your bacon at room temperature because it's more pliable and stretchable. And it will stick better to you to your drumstick, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and finish these up. We have the char griller outside warming up right now. So we're gonna cook these at 250 degrees. We're gonna put a little cherry wood in the char griller. It's really windy outside, so I can't record outside today. Um, so we'll just show you, putting, show you us putting it on the char griller and these pieces of bacon here are a little short so I may be resigned to put two pieces of bacon with the center cut bacon but hey you can never have too much bacon right all right we'll finish these up and then we'll get them on the char griller all right so we got our temperature up I'm going to go ahead and get these bad boys on in our greased rack. And we'll see what we get.
All right, guys, so we're finished with our cook. I'll put a total cook time up here on the screen. We got our drumsticks sitting back here, and they've been sitting back here probably for about seven to eight minutes trying to finish watching the end of the football game. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and have our taste test now. As you saw, we used uh, Postal Barbecue's chicken rub seasoning on the uh, drumsticks themselves. We didn't put any additional seasoning on the bacon, and then we brushed uh, all of the drumsticks at the end with blazing boar uh, barbecue sauce. Let's go ahead and have a taste. And these smell good, man. These smell fantastic. They look, they look nice too, man. I love the way that bacon looks around the drumstick. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay, so I'm not a big fan of drumsticks, but I will eat these all day long. Okay, bacon makes everything better. Okay, the the drumstick being dark meat is already moist. Okay. But the bacon just added another level of moisture to the drumstick itself. The smokiness from the wood and the charcoal from the Char Griller 980 is fantastic. The bacon is nice and crispy. The sweetness of the barbecue, the blazing boar barbecue sauce adds a great level of flavor. And that chicken rub from Postal Barbecue is, uh, is top notch. So these are fantastic. Got to have another bite. Oh, yeah, these would be great party favorites, man. If you're having a little get-together, like I said, I'm not a big fan of drumsticks, but these are fantastic, okay? Like I said, bacon makes everything better, okay? Well, that's about all we have time for today. Hey, I want to thank Jabin from Postal Barbecue for sending us his rubs. So far, they are fantastic. I love the kind of the lime citrusy flavor in some of his rubs, so it tastes very good. It gives a, a extra dimension to his rubs, okay? So, and I said, if you're interested in getting the char griller, man, hey, check it out. I have loved that ever since I got it for a present from the wife. That's one of my favorite grills. Like I said, charcoal and wood flavor with the control of a pellet smoker. You cannot go wrong with that, okay? Well, that's it. Like we always say, where there's smoke, there's fire. If it's fire, then damn it, there just might be a barbecue there. Hey, if you're not subscribed, hey, consider subscribing to the channel and hit like for this video if you like what we did here. It'll definitely help us out. And as always, guys, hey, we'll see you guys around the smoke. Bacon makes everything better. Mm.